Hey guys, James saying. So this is a video about the Asus, make sure I get it right, the Asus Zen Screen 24-inch 1080p portable USB monitor. It's FHD, IPS, whatever that means, Type-C speaker, multi-stand, design kickstand, C-clamp, arm, partition, hooks, carry, handle. Um, so basically what I want to do is hook up my... Yeah. So I want to hook up my laptop. I take it to the drop zone. Uh, sometimes it's hard to get a room. It's hard to get access to. to everybody's standing around trying to watch the skydiving videos on a small screen. So I want a bigger screen. So that's my goal to see how well does this uh, monitor do hooked up and when you play back a 4K video. So you got a big old box here from... Amazon. So let's get this open. Let's get this open and uh have a facey tape. How about that? Oh this is not going to be an unboxing video, but it's gonna be how well does this do? I didn't have function. Fix this here and let's get rid of it. Oh, let's get rid of that box. This is how big the box is. So like I said, not an unboxing video, but let's get this open and see how it does play in the uh, video when it is oh. slaved over. All right, so we got this out of the box. Well, let's flip this around. So we got this out of the box. I, I put the mounting hardware aside. I don't, I, I don't care about it now. I don't care about it in the future. So you have a power power cable and then I can connect HDMI to HDM, HDMI to HDMI and USB-C to USB-C. So, uh, so let's get this first. I do want to see probably I, yeah, I, I'm no expert on electronics. I think HDMI probably is a higher quality. No, I don't know. I don't know how many megabytes, gigabytes, or whatever it can transfer. All right, so this is the monitor. Yep. We'll set that aside. So, um, pretty, pretty big monitor. Pretty big monitor. Pretty big monitor. So, it's got this fold down here. So this kickstand type thing. All right, so we have that. That's adjustable to different angles. I don't think that's going to run off the power of my laptop. So for right now, I'm just going to plug it in. So on one side, I have HDMI and USB-C on one side. And that looks like power at the bottom. And then there's some controls. Oh, good. I can do a, I can do a Kensington lock. I didn't know it had that, though. I'm, I'm really glad it does have that. So you buy a four, four hundred, three hundred fifty dollar monitor. Then you gotta go get an airplane and skydive. You don't want to leave it just sitting there, but it's... this cable. on. It's a three prong, if you needed to know that, it's three prongs. And then I'm first I'm gonna hook up uh, HDMI to HDMI. I have the laptop plugged in. Now I've got the Asus Zen screen MB249C as in Charlie plugged in. All right, and so let's do Set that cable aside. Let's do HDMI. To use the HDMI on that side. Let's run this cable behind. And go to HDMI here. Okay, so let's turn the laptop on. Let's find the power button for this. Over here on the side, I'm assuming that's a power button. 
I like, guess yeah, so let's take, well, you can see this. Okay, so right now I have my laptop set up for that monitor there. I guess let's put these closer together. Okay, so I'm not going to change any of the brightness right now. So what I am going to do is bring up, I just have some skydiving footage on my computer. It pops up over here. So let's just bring, I don't know, that's just... Can I get both of them on the same screen? All right, so the HDMI at the moment seems to be doing pretty good. I like that. Oh, that, yeah, that is, oh, oh, there's, it got a little jumpy. Oh, well, it's jumpy on the laptop, too. Actually, it stopped being jumpy. That was, that was as, as much a laptop, and that's a new laptop. I think it only has eight gigabytes of RAM, even though it's a new laptop. So... Pause that for a second. Let's get to the skydive. Maybe my new laptop doesn't hand, handle video as well as my old laptop. It has a faster processor. All right, so here we go. It's playing on both. Oh, this laptop's going a little slow. Well, it seems to be playing as slow. We don't, yeah, we don't move that slow in the sky. All right, so the Asus is doing great. My new laptop. Shit, let me get my old laptop. So right now I'm happy with the HDMI hookup. Um, but that's not real speed though. That's yeah. Before I before I switched to my other computer, I did. I wanted to test this setup on. USB-C. So I took the HDMI cable out, plugged in a USB-C to a USB-C. Let's see how that video plays. This that that was 4K. I don't know what that one was. No, this is 2.7K. Let's look at another video. All right, so we can see both at the same time. I can quit jostling this around. All right, so the USB-C, this plays well. Maybe it doesn't play back 4K as well. Maybe I stay in eight more megabytes of RAM, so I have to investigate that for that laptop. But this too, this is 2.7, and you know, no, this is my buddy, he's shooting for it's Nathan shooting 4K here. So this is playing back fine. I don't know who's that other video. I uh, said so this place fine. Okay, guys, so I also have this, uh, I got this carrying case for the Asus 24 inch monitor. I like it a lot. I haven't taken it out yet, but I will this week into the drop zone. See, it's got a zipper on the front for places to put all these cables. Where I found one hooked up, I got power, HDMI cable, USB C, and it does have a smaller. <gasps> Uh, one in the back, which I don't have anything on there. So it's kind of ingenious. Well, I don't know if it's ingenious. But anyway, it, it, where else? It's got these buckle connectors. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, so there's eight of them. So, that's the way that works. And then that just, you know, your monitor goes from there, so. There's no screen. I don't have a screen protector. There's, this didn't come with a carrying case, so this is really nice. This, I would lay this down. This is the most padded side, so I'd put the screen down. And then this just fits in here and gets put back together the way I had it. All right, so I'll leave a link. I'm really liking this uh, portable carrying case. And so I primarily, primarily use this 24-inch monitor at the drop zone so we can review our videos. And this is the ASUS monitor on the left on the table. Um, and I haven't used it in direct sunlight. I don't plan to. It's always in open shade. It, it is a phenomenal picture. It is so much easier to look at than the small screen. So I'm extremely happy and would highly recommend this product.